Is there an anti-periodic table of elements? Yes. Antimatter is not just one substance. Every particle has a corresponding antiparticle. So electrons have positrons, quarks have antiquarks. I said every, before people start typing in the comments, yes, some particles are their own antiparticles, like photons. Anyway, the point is, anything that we could find, you know, made out of matter, you could also find made out of antimatter. So when you make antihydrogen in a lab, you have an antiproton, and you have a positron, you kind of smash them together, and see if they stick. For that matter, there's anti-every element, anti-helium, anti-lithium, it's just whatever the corresponding element is made out of antimatter. In fact, if there was no matter in existence, you wouldn't even be able to tell that it's antimatter. I mean, primarily, the thing that we know about antimatter is that it annihilates with matter and creates a big release of energy. But antimatter, in a very real way, is just like matter reversed. It interacts with itself. It interacts with other antimatter the same way that matter reacts with matter. So if there was a whole planet, a whole species made of antimatter out there, we would look like we were made of antimatter to them, and they would look like they were made of matter. But we can tell that there's not, because if there was, we would see evidence of annihilation reactions along the border where the antimatter and the matter meet. And since we don't, it's pretty safe to say that the universe is made of matter.